This is Hannibal here from TheHannibalTV.com and I'm just sorting through some of my wrestling books and I wanted to go through the ones that I have signed for you guys. This is from Jacques Rougeau. He says, to my best student, a good friend, Jacques Rougeau. And he also trained Kevin Owens, Jeremy Prophet, and his son, Emile Jean-Jacques, and Cedric. So that's nice of him. Bill Anderson, who I've interviewed. I've interviewed pretty much all of these guys. Superstar Billy Graham actually signed this copy uh, for me as well. Of course, Billy's one of my mentors. And Bill writes to Devin, thank you for taking a look at my books. Best wishes for all you do. And this is a, a picture book from Bill Anderson. Here's Sabu's book, who I've wrestled a, a couple of times and done interviews with. Just a basic signature. Tank Abbott, who is a friend of mine. These are, are fictional books, but they are actually kayfabe fictional. He's one of the one of the nicer guys in wrestling. Sorry about the glare. Mr. Bob Backlund, who uh, I've done a couple interviews with. What does he say here? To Devin, never capitulate. Bob Backlund, if anyone knows what that means, put it in the comments. Ah, uh, this one from Lanny Poffo, passed away this year. To Hannibal Lanny Poffo. He actually gave me that the night after we recorded our little locker room fiasco. Uh, Tony Atlas, who I've done, I think, four or five interviews with. I also bought one of his pictures, which, by the way, he never actually sent me. So there's a warning for people about that. But here we go. Tony Atlas, WWE Hall of Famer. Good guy. Adventures in Larry Land, Larry Zabisco, one of the really nice guys in wrestling, and one of the funniest interviews. There we go, Hall of Famer, class of 2015, Nikita Koloff. Uh, that was a really, I've done a couple interviews with him, and he says, hope this book blesses me. Well, let's, let's take that as of today, and <laughs> not when he signed it. Forrest Griffin, there was a good uh, he's UFC Hall of Famer, and I really enjoyed the interview with him because he also gave me the tour of the UFC's facility in Las Vegas, which both of those are on my channel. Um, that was a real honor to get a tour of that place. And, and this is actually a great book about fighting and the mentality it takes to fight. Very useful. Dr. D. David Schultz, I've done a couple interviews with. And it's a pretty good book. What does he say here? To Devin, best wishes, Dr. D. David Schultz. J.J. Dillon, who I have a three-hour shoot interview with. He says, to Devin, all the best. J.J. Dillon, the leader of the Four Horsemen. And why does he say wrestlers are like seagulls? I uh, believe it was because they ate shit, something like that. That's why you named the book. Wrestlers are like seagulls. Scott Teal, wrestling photographer and former son-in-law of Dick the Bruiser, as you can see in there. Um, Hannibal, your videos and life story is awesome. What you do to contribute to the wrestling business is much appreciated. Keep up the excellent work. 